welcome back you guys i am so excited i know i say that all the time but i am so excited to bring you today's video because it's approaching my favorite time of year you guys which is christmas okay i know you've heard this all the time from different people or whatever but honestly even before youtube christmas has always been my favorite time of year i'm also excited because this is going to be my first christmas series here on youtube I have had my Christmas tree here on YouTube, you guys, but I didn't really get to decorate it. We had just moved back to the States. My belongings were a little bit delayed and we got them back a couple days before Christmas. So I kind of salvaged it by putting up the Christmas tree a couple days before Christmas. So that doesn't really count. This year, I get to show you guys how I'll be decorating my Christmas tree and I just can't wait. Not only will this year be my first decorating series here on YouTube, it will be our first holiday in the new house. So I'm just bursting with excitement, you guys. Um, I'm so excited for the season. I cannot wait to share with you guys all the ideas. Honestly, I can't wait for all the ideas to come to light because right now they're just here. <laughs> Right now, my ideas are just in my head, so hopefully you guys like whatever I come up with. Um, but today, I'm going to be unboxing my Christmas tree, getting it ready and prepped for all the beautiful festive decorations that I've been gathering, and I cannot wait, you guys. Like, I am so excited. I can't wait. I really feel like, I even feel like I should be further along. But you know what? Life is happening and I'm getting prepped. And in today's video, you will see some of that preparation. I actually haven't seen my Christmas tree. Um, I purchased it from Amazon. I'm praying that the size is just right. It's a seven and a half foot Christmas tree. So I know the height will be fine. I'm just hoping it's not too narrow or it's not too wide. I don't think it's going to be too wide, but I'm hoping it's not too narrow. Um, so let's just go ahead and see what's inside the box and see what it looks like and get it fluffed prepped and ready okay you guys let's get started okay home stylers don't laugh but i ran into my first problem i have no idea where to put this christmas tree <laughs> i want to put it over the window but since my couch isn't here i'm not really sure how the layout is going to be um i have it one way in my head but i really do not know so what i think i'm going to do is to move the swivel chairs from right here um, shift them to the other side and unbox my Christmas tree right on this wall. Maybe I can even tuck it in the corner until I have everything situated. So yeah, now that that has been solved, let's do the unboxing home stylers. <laughs> I think we have enough space to work with so I'm just gonna go ahead and bring the box in now it's time to unbox okay I've got my box cutter I'm so excited <laughs>
not sure which one this is. If this is the bottom, the middle, I don't think it's the top given the size. Um, so I'm just gonna try to figure out, it looks like the middle, but let me try to figure out which one, which one it is. was the bottom home stylers let me just see yeah this looks like the bottom given this little thing here you would think I would look for the directions right Lots of fluffing to do. I'm excited, but this is a lot of work. Okay. So, home stylers, my initial thoughts on this Christmas tree is that it's a beautiful tree. Love the flocking detail. I really wanted something that's going to mimic winter icy wonderland. Not necessarily the fairy style winter wonderland, more like winter forest, um, like a freeze over winter forest. And I think this Christmas tree is gonna help me bring that to light. Um, really love the tree. However, I think next year I'm gonna go for a little bit bigger tree. But for now, I'm gonna get it fluffed and ready for all the beautiful decorations. So stay tuned. Okay, so you guys saw that I brought reinforcement, right? So she's gonna go ahead and start on the bottom and I'm gonna go up top and try to separate these branches.
one thing I'm realizing, home stylers, is that this tree has a natural flow. So even though I'm trying to spread these um, stems, it does kind of open naturally. Um, so I'm just kind of going along with the flow here. And I'm not noticing a lot of shedding, which is a plus for me. There is some shedding, but it's not excessive at all. So I'm happy about that. So I think this is a good stopping point. I'm more likely going to be opening the tree as I go and see little pockets that needs to be um, refined. But for now, this is what it looks like, fluffed. And I forgot to mention home sellers. If you guys are interested and will be getting this tree, it does come with a protective paper. You can open this paper, lay it underneath the stand before you get everything all set up. Me being me, I knew how to put a Christmas tree together so I didn't even look at the directions. Um, but I did find the protective paper in the box and wanted to just share that with you guys. So now home stylers, I'm going to clean up a little bit and then I'll show you guys what the tree looks like all lit. So home stylers, we're almost to the end. I want you guys to stay tuned for the reveal because I really want you guys to see what a tree looks like when it's all fluffed versus one that is unfluffed. I really think that whether you have a brand new tree or you've been storing your tree, it's a good idea to take it out and have it fluffed. I feel like it creates a good foundation for when you're decorating your tree because I think it gives you less gaps to fill and it just makes everything look whole and makes your decoration look that much more beautiful. I will be back Wednesday with another video. We finally went ahead and installed our chandelier and I can't wait to share that with you guys. Go ahead and check and make sure your notification bells are on. Also give this video a thumbs up and if you're new here, welcome. I would love to have you guys stay and subscribe. I really hope this video bring you guys some holiday cheers as well as some inspiration to start your holiday prep if you guys haven't already started but for now home stylers stay blessed and until next time later